Good morning, Hellions. Welcome to day number, what is this, 1,973. And I only know that because two more years and it'll be my birthday year. Is this your birthday year? Post it down in the comments. And you can do that while we get through the intro. Make sure to hit the thumbs up button too. If there's enough time to do that, we'll see you on the other side. For the last 1,900 74, I think, days now, I've picked up a camera and I've filmed every day of my life, which is, it's a huge task. You, you don't realize how difficult it is every day. And then, especially when there's some things you can film and some things you can't, and I'm not talking about just like, you know, a regular normal person, yeah, I use the N-word, but a regular normal person picking up the camera, trying not to... Uh, film like people that don't want to be filmed or your address or your phone number. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about personal life things that happen every day that I would love to share with you, but I can't because it's brought up in court. You know, the courts have told me um, that, well, they've told both parties that, you know, we shouldn't discuss litigation, especially on social media platforms or whatnot. And, you know, I, I can, I see that point and that's why I haven't I haven't said much of anything. Um, however, yesterday, I come home to a notice on my door. And I'm like, huh. And this is after my attorney called me. So this is not in litigation yet. This has not been entered into the courts yet. So I figured, you know, what the hell? I want to share this with you guys because this is just a part of my life that's happening right now. It's so difficult on choosing what I can say and what I can't say because I'm never in the right. I am never, ever, anymore in the right. Everything that I do on social media isn't just viewed by you guys and it's like, ha ha, look at Troy doing that, or oh, that was kind of cool, or oh gosh, that was so boring. No, things that I do now on social media are stalked. Um, they are blown out of proportion. They are brought into the court system. This is what I deal with, guys, on a daily freaking basis. Every single day. Every single day. There's some things I don't show you because it's like, oh, God, I don't want to show that because then that's going to be brought up in court too. It's just, what, what do I show you? You know, it, it's a part of me wants to say, you know, screw it. I'm just going to stop flicking, flicking, ah, flick, flick. No, a part of me says that I just, I'm just going to stop vlogging. But you know something, if I do that, then other people have won. And I've done this for too long. This is just what I do. I know it's gotten away from Halloween, I apologize for that, but hopefully with this a little bit, you guys can see why it's it's taken this, this other turn. Oh my God, I cannot tell you what other people are alleging. And I've been knocking them down. I have, I've been knocking them down. But they just keep, it's like the Tasmanian devil sitting there muddying up the waters. And the waters aren't clearing. <laughs> they are not clearing anytime soon. In fact, I'm probably not even going to include any of this. I don't know. You know, yesterday at the end of the vlog, I said, you know, thank goodness for my friends. Because they're the ones that I can talk to. They're the ones that I can discuss things with. They know me mess. They know me mess. Well, I am messy sometimes. They know me best. Um, they know all the crap. And they're still my friends. And they're still my friends because they, they see what's at stake. So I come home yesterday to a, uh, a warning notice that uh, Buffy had allegedly bit my son. <gasps> Something that I would have been highly aware of if it had happened. And uh, just to let you guys know, I take a picture of Phoenix before he leaves and when he gets here every single time because of stuff like this. Everything is crazy right now and I really wish that I could get into it. And one day I will. One day I will blow all this open and I will tell you guys exactly what is going on. Why? Because it's my life and I have the First Amendment right of free speech. I can say whatever I want as long as it's truthful. All right. So with that being said, Troy is going to head on to the backyard and get some aggression out by mowing the grass. I want to pick up poop first. Well, okay, that's kind of funny too. I was going to say, isn't it funny how you cut the grass first time of the year and then after that it just grows like a weed and then the second thing is, look at this, it's, the table's kind of floating, like, like the bright objects look like ghosts. Oh. Actually, 
Oh. <laughs> that sounded more like Hank Hill, didn't it? Oh, damn it, Bobby. Oh, that did not sound like Hank Hill, sorry. Oh man, I didn't do it before and after. Oh, I kind of did. I guess I showed the yard from the from the window, right? All right, so I have trimmed, I have trimmed the yard. Look at this, it's like a jungle. <laughs> you guys don't realize how tall the grass is until you're down in it. All right, and there is the result of the first mow of the year for the front yard. Ah, look, the buds on the trees, the smell of fresh cut grass. I missed a spot. Oops, oh well. I'll get it next time. I'm realizing I'm headed the exact same way that I was headed before when I was talking about the grass. Anyway, guys, I'm headed out to my friend's house right now. I've got the GoPro bom, right there. Um, so I want to give you some like uh, roadside footage or whatever. Roadside. Hopefully it's not roadside. I want to give you some footage via the road. Because I'm headed to my friend's house and I'm probably not going to film a whole lot because I need to just chill with my friends for a little while. So, hope you guys understand. Let's get on some road footage, shall we? Fade to road, oh, oh, fail, fail, fail. Hold on, let me try it again. Yeah, there we go. Fade to road footage now. All right, guys, had a great visit with my friends. I sincerely appreciate you guys for letting me take this time to uh, to, to do this, to, to not vlog for a little while, and basically sit back and, and do a little relaxing and uh, whatever else it is I do when you have friends. This actual clip right here probably won't make it into the vlog because it's something that I did before we got in the freeway, but. This is what I have to do. I have to convert my footage before I can use it or else the computer says, eh, I don't like it. I'm gonna crash mid-render and then when you wake up, the vlog won't be rendered. Ha 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 ha. So, I'm making sure that that doesn't happen. That's why I convert them. All right, so we got the GoPro. We got the, the, the hair tool. <laughs> got my coffee, the mouse. We're ready to go. Gonna get this edited. Uh, while I'm waiting for this to um, process, I'm going to do COC right now. Ha! <laughs> That's funny. Uh, instead of clicking the, the comments or whatever, I clicked show more. Well, that just shows that we've got the GoFundMe over here. We've got the mailing address over here. We've got haunt sauce. Well, actually, we've got one haunt sauce left. Um, vampire blood incense. We've got glow in the dark keychain, shot glasses, ballpoint pants, all that stuff's over there. We got the website, Facebook, 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 Twitter, you now, Snapchat, Periscope, Instagram, Vine, and our other channels. It's all down below. So I decided since I, I clicked on show or show more instead of top comments, which we go down to newest first. When we go down to newest first, we are able to find out who was first. Who was the first comment? Andrew's video is first, congratulations, yay! Jim Erickson, more candy corn and still got all that cake left. You might have to get a bigger pant size. I know, I know. Halloween Horror House, isn't putting an automatic in neutral while coasting bad? No? Mm, no? I don't think so, saves gas. See North, please don't eat all that sugar. Between the cakes and candy corn, your pancreas will hate you. Diabetes is a bitch. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna eat it, not all at once. <laughs> Timothy Jones, ha ha ha. Buffy the Slayer of everything, one. Ball, zero. <laughs> what will be next? I don't know. Oh, Alan Howe, my friend and haunt partner were born in 1972, raise his hand, awesome. And uh, what is today? Today's 1973, right? Anybody born in 1973? Raise your hands, raise your hands. Adam Owens, car question, what's your opinion on seafoam? 
eh, I, I've never used it. That's a long conversation. That's a very long conversation. Um, I've been told uh, by a few people it is good. Just wanted more opinions. I just put it in the gas tank for now. Um, just remember, if you use a high detergent gasoline like Shell, Chevron, Texaco, things like that, um, then fuel is self-cleaning. The only problem you have is when you use a lower uh, grade gasoline and it attaches itself to the fuel injectors and the valves after you shut off the engine, causes slack, and then you get runnability problems, blah, blah, blah. Um, yeah, so just make sure that you're, you've got a good gasoline in there. And you also say, uh, sorry to hear what's going on with everything. Thank you. <laughs> Wondering Sharon, was that a five pound bag of candy corn? Yes. Yes, it was. And that was the final comment of the night. Thank you guys for commenting. Happy haunting. See you guys tomorrow. Uh, it's, again, it's always freaking late when I do this, so I don't even have to say it anymore. It's dark outside. That's all you need to know. Happy haunting. See you guys tomorrow. That was another terrifying tale from the hell mouth. Tune in tomorrow, boys and ghouls for another terrifying chapter. <laughs>